Many of the famous Western heroes and villains were hanging around in California at the time that Hollywood was getting going. Wyatt Earp settled in Los Angeles in the last years of his life and became a bit of a fixture around the movie business. John Ford made great Westerns, made silent Westerns, and, and Earp would come visit those John Ford sets. Earp talked to John Wayne and made an impact on Wayne. And Wayne says, this was a man who had actually done the things in his life that I was trying to do in a movie. I imitated his walk. I imitated his talk. I know who you are now. And I know why you quit the Cimarron country, too. The threatening, slow way of talking and that, that John Wayne drawl that was imitated by, by so many. But of course, he was imitating Wyatt Earp. My father said he, he basically plays Wyatt Earp. When he has to play a sheriff or a leader or go into something, he goes in like he's Wyatt Earp. The Western is the perfect palette for that American stoicism. It was that, that romantic challenge of the West, which as we know, was anything but romantic. It was harsh, it was short-lived, you know, lives were short, disease was rampant, violence was the vernacular of the day, and ultimately he can trust nobody except himself. That is the Western.